Hello and welcome back to New and Old Survival. This is Darren, and I've got something interesting, so you'll want to stick around. Now, coming out of the winter months, it's often cloudy here in the Appalachians in Southwest Virginia. And a lot of us are missing our vitamin D and that's why I'm out here today without a shirt on, but you don't need to see all of that. But I'm recouping the, the feel good vitamin D, which is also uh, very important for nerve health. As you see that milk is, um, has vitamin D added to it. And that's because it also helps to assist in your body's ability to absorb the calcium and get that to your bones and such. But I'm going to show you a way to increase your vitamin D in case you live in a climate where there is not much sun. Uh, you know, you have a couple of sunny days for a little bit, uh, not, then you go a long time and you don't have another bout of sun. This is mushrooms, as you can probably tell. And my wife, since learning about this method, has become very eager and proficient at doing this. What we're doing is dehydrate, dehydrating, getting tongue tied in the sun. Mushrooms already contain a good amount of vitamin D, but by placing them in the sun, you can absorb uh, the sun's rays, obviously, and increase the vitamin D content up to about 40% higher than what you started out with. This is good for MS, and of course bone deterioration because it'll help your body to absorb the calcium. I just wanted to pass that little quick tip to you. And if you're worried about bugs being on them, if you just want to lightly sprinkle some salt and pepper over top of them, it'll not only keep uh, your mushrooms tasty, add a little bit of seasoning, but it'll also deter those bugs that might want to get up on them. You or you don't have to. You might have heard Angel say in the background. They need to be gills up. They do need to be gills up, as she just pointed out. And sorry, my camera's not in focus. So, just another quick tip. Thought you might want to know. Thank you for joining me back again today. I do appreciate all your likes and subscribes. As I said in another video, or I don't know if I'm going to post this one before the other one, but we've now hit and went above a thousand subscribers. So, thank you. Now, also, you can check us out on Facebook, New and Old Survival. I do post things on there that does not make it to video. So I ask to, for you to join me and drop a comment, like, subscribe to this channel, and I hope to be able to help you be become more self-sufficient in the near future for troubling times ahead.